So, Ross Kent, you had access, as you made very clear in your documentary, you had access to Belmarsh Prism for the first time in history. And you focused on the Pope brothers. And you focused on a few people protesting outside because I was unlawfully arrested and imprisoned for a civil offence in a maximum security jail. That was your focus. You acted like the biggest concern the governor of that prison had was to do with a bit of spice or the fact that I was in there. When you showed a little two second clip of someone getting boiling water with sugar thrown over them for disrespecting Islam. When you was in my cell and you interviewed me, you cut everything I said, but I made it clear you should be focusing on jihadis in jail, the control of the prison. You didn't even mention it. The biggest problem Belmarsh prison has. You have access and you steer well clear like a total coward, a waste of an opportunity of a documentary to highlight a serious issue. Someone come out of Belmarsh two, three days ago and went on a killing spree, yeah? Attempted killing spree. Terrorists are controlling that jail. He didn't even focus on it. He didn't even talk about it. Typical. Absolutely typical. Why not? You failed. A complete waste of an opportunity of a documentary. You're probably told you weren't allowed to talk about the jihadis in jail. In fact, whilst I was in Belmarsh Prison, I do in every jail speak to the staff. I found out one of the staff, just weeks before I got there, which you know, because I spoke to you about it, Ross, was violently battered, okay? Battered from the side by two black lads, yeah? Who had converted to Islam. After beating him, they said, that's for the brothers. The brothers being the religious hierarchy of radical extremists in control of the jail that you didn't talk about. But I know you know about it. I know you know about it because a member of staff who it happened to was with you and me at the time. So I know you know about it. But you didn't report on it. You sit on Piers Morgan's show. You had your perfect opportunity to say the biggest problem this country has, the biggest threat we have, 800 radicalised prisoners come out every year. 800. That's MI5 statistics. 800 are coming out of prison. That's not terrorists. That's potential terrorists. Would be terrorists. Converted. Radicalised. You had the opportunity to highlight it. You've done fuck all, mate. Total waste. Total waste. Some journalist. Some real journalist.